Hello, I am Monica. New Year, New Version We couldn't find a better way to start 2025 than by releasing a new version of OpenZava, more secure, more robust, more of everything. Version 7.4.5 is a maintenance release where the most important changes are bug fixes. Additionally, we have updated some third-party libraries, made some small improvements, and worked on the documentation. It's worth updating, there are no compatibility issues with the previous version, and our application will be more secure and robust. We have made some improvements to the API, such as the filter by content in any property method in tab, which filters to include any record that contains part of that string in any field, working with string, number, boolean, date columns, etc. We have also adapted the OpenZava code so that the OpenXavatist suite can be launched from Visual Studio Code. Visual Studio Code was already supported for working on your projects. The new improvement is interesting when you have your own modified version of OpenZava. We have updated the dependencies for the embedded Tomcat, Jersey, JSON, JSOUP, and Log4J. Additionally, we have also updated the JDBC driver version for AS400 used in the documentation and in the palm.xml of new projects. We have also improved the documentation, especially with the inclusion of two new videos of our report generation course. And finally, the most important, the bugs. We have fixed several security vulnerabilities, some bugs related to tree behavior, and many other bugs from other areas. To update to the latest version of OpenZava, you don't need to download OpenZava Studio again. In fact, you don't need to download anything at all. All you have to do is change the version number in the palm.xml of your projects. Let's take a look. Open your project's palm.xml file. In the openzava.version entry write 7.4.5 and save. On the project, choose Run As. Maven Clean. Then go to Run As. And choose Maven Install. Wait a moment. And your project is already upgraded to 7.4.5 and ready to run. Moreover, from now on, when you create a new project from OpenZava Studio, it will default to version 7.4.5 without you having to configure anything. OpenZava Studio always uses the latest available version for new projects. To know all the details, I recommend checking the full announcement on the openxava.org blog. In the video description, you will find the direct link. Bye.